Hi everybody, it's me, Fallen Angel. I know I sound <laughs> stuffed up. It's because I'm sick, and you probably can see my eye watering right now. I caught a head cold. Of course, I'm always getting sick, and I hate it. <coughs> but that ain't gonna stop me from recording. <laughs> this means I can just gotta push through. But ignore my ucky voice, ignore my ucky face. I'm sorry. I just, ugh, I feel icky today. But hopefully I'll get better in a couple of days. But I'm still going. So we are continuing with the Amber's Analogs. I think last time we played, uh, we found the radio call for SOS, and uh, David woke up, but then he passed back out. We think that he something seriously is wrong with David. So. Okay. Okay, no. so let's see what happens. I lost my teddy! I need my teddy! Hey, it's okay. It, it's okay. We'll find him. Of course! He can't... He can't have gotten far. Why don't you keep an eye on, on her and I'll go look... I have a look around. Finding a lost bear? It's a perfect job for a mom. I'll keep up. I'll keep a watch on our little flyer. <clears throat> While Pamela and I look after the other passengers too. Chill out. <clears throat> I know. 
stars it'd be amazing. Oh this horrible crap this happening right now. We've got lots of doctors who can patch Teddy up in no time. I'm on it. Why don't you come over here with me, little one, and I'll show you how to fix up your friend. Right? I just couldn't stand to lose you, too, like Noah. And both my fault? So many people I love get hurt because of me. <laughs> hey, sorry, I guess I overheard you a bit. Oh, Clark. I wasn't trying to eavesdrop. Sorry about that. Are you okay? Would you prefer some time alone? No, no, it's nothing. It's just... You don't need to tell me anything, Amber, but I think we both know it's a bit more than nothing. It's just, well, it's just, say the crash back, 
crash brought back some old memories. I actually felt my flight attendant exam the first time around because of the swimming part. Um, I can't. When I was a kid, my... No, never mind, it's nothing. Amber, sometimes it's best to talk about those things. I guess Noah is someone pretty, who's pretty important to you. Yes. Well, you're an important person to me too, so I'm here if you want to talk. Thanks for caring. You're a good person, Clark. I feel exactly the same about you, Amber Hope. Now, let's save your friend. Actually, I should get back to looking after the other pa passengers. We both have jobs to do. You've got this. I believe in you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Looking jellyfish floating around here. <laughs> oh, she got stung. Ouch, that must sting. Hold on a second. I know just the thing. <laughs> Olivera leaves. One of the best burn remedies out there. Anyone else get stung? Probably got a could have taken a, the hint that I didn't want to talk. True. But you mean well. I think you always mean well, don't you, Clark? I hope so. And look who's talking. <laughs> Come on, lay down. You need water and sleep. You know humans need sleep, right? I mean, they do teach you that at Doctor Yourself to Death Doctor School, right? <clears throat> Must have skipped that lecture. <clears throat> I had to start all over. I forgot about Clark. <laughs> God. Whoops. I was too busy taking care of everyone else.
from the park. <laughs> I'm not gonna put it to you this time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. 
Good luck. Right, go. Get out. Alright. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes. Oh, thank God, yes. Please, come save us. We're tired of sunburns and airplane food. Transmitting your coordinates now. The team is on the way. Yay! <clears throat> Casualties and most of our injured are back to full health. Good work, Kyle. We did it together. That was all you. I should have listened to you from the start. We wouldn't have avoided this whole disaster. Actually, why were you so stubborn that anyway? Honestly, uh, please. Because I love you, and I had a plan to tell you just how much. And while being stranded on this mysterious island after a plane crash isn't quite how I planned it. It currently has its own charm and romance. <laughs> I'm not a perfect man. I don't pretend to be. But there is one perfect thing in my life, and that's you. Oh my god! Karen, will you marry me? I... well... Yes, yes, of course I'll marry you. Even though sometimes you'll be a... you're a total... We're gonna stop. My throat is killing me and I can't no longer keep up with the voices. <laughs> but, oh my god, Karen and Kyle's gonna get married. That's cool. And we're about to get rescued off this island. Hopefully, David will wake up before we get rescued. But, it looks like it ain't gonna be too good. But,. Thank you for bearing with me through my sickness. I'm sorry again. But I'm going to try to get better. I have medicine, so I'm going to take it after I get off here. But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And comment down below. Hopefully I get better. But I am so grateful for all of you. I am. Y'all are more than any number. Y'all are like my family, and I'm lucky to have all y'all. And I'm lucky for all the support y'all you y'all have been giving me. And I really, really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe, please. I'd love for everyone to become part of my family. But, I guess I'll see y'all in the next video. Much love, my angels. Bye, guys.